Hey guys, so I'm here today. I'm going to be shaving my face. I'm going to see how this works, if it hurts or not. My one friend recommended it to me, so I'm going to try it out. I got the cute pink one, of course. Also, please like and subscribe down below. Let's get started. I have not something super important tonight, but like kind of important. So I'm really hoping this doesn't like make my face really red and look weird. I am going to be putting makeup on too. And then I'll tell you guys if it helped when I applied my makeup because my one friend said it applied her makeup better because she didn't have like little peach fuzz and stuff. So we'll try it out. I'm really hoping it doesn't like mess up my face. Because I have like little hairs right here that I don't like. And then like everyone has peach fuzz here and then right here. So let's see. I'm kind of scared. I probably shouldn't be trying this on a day that I actually want my face to somewhat look good. But you know, my always living on the edge. Okay, so the brand is called Flawless Facial Hair Remover Finishing Touch as seen on TV. Okay, so it comes with a battery. How generous. Um, a little brush to clean the hair out and then the little device. So it comes in this little packaging and then you take this off and here's the thing. So it says slide gold switch up to turn on. Sweet. Let's put the battery in. Just so you guys know too, I've never shaved my face, so I don't know if the hair's gonna grow back fuller or not. I really hope not. It says on the back though, hair will not grow back thicker guaranteed. So that's a guarantee that they have, so. Also, I heard it is a myth that your hair grows back thicker. We'll see. Don't really know. Hopefully not. Here it turns on. You just push the switch up with the little light. And let's get going into it. I'm really scared. So circular motions is the best. So I'm going to use my magnifying mirror. Okay. I don't know if you can hear that, but you hear it all getting my hair. So that's exciting. That is insane. It doesn't hurt at all, which I thought it might hurt a little bit. Okay, let's do, let me move this closer. Let's do my forehead. That is wild. could easily get some like straight away eyebrow hair I feel like and I see it's actually like getting it off overall I really did like this I think let's see if the hair grows back like thicker or not so I feel like I have no hair on my face right now which is kind of crazy because I never shaved my face like I've said I think I kind of put some dry patches on my skin just because it's like a rough-ish area but that's okay overall I think it went really well it was super quick and I'm glad it did not hurt because if it hurt, I could not use it. I have a very low pain tolerance. That's really all I have. I'm going to be putting on some makeup. And I will update you guys how I like it with makeup on. And yeah. So I'll be right back. Put on my makeup. And let's see what it looks like then. So guys, um, I'm back. I put on all my makeup. And I really love how it looks, honestly. I'm not for sure if I applied it better or anything. But I think it just looks overall better. Because you don't see any little hairs like I used to have. As well as like it kind of fixed up my eyebrows really easily and quickly. So overall I would recommend it. It's only $19 and you can usually get like a coupon or something off of it. Because you can get an Ulta or Target. I got mine at Ulta and I got 20% off too. There's a really pretty purple one and then there's a white one. Um, but yeah I really do like this and overall right now would recommend it. Um, I just really hope my hair doesn't grow back thicker or anything. But overall I do like it. And it was so quick, didn't hurt at all. The price range is pretty great because you can keep reusing it. And overall, yeah, I would recommend it. Out of five stars, I'd probably get like a 4.5. I don't see anything wrong with it. It's affordable, really easy to use, and very quick. I could do this in the morning really quick if I forgot to do it the night before and get it done. And it doesn't leave any red spots or anything, which is really nice. It doesn't really irritate the skin at all. Just use it right before if you need to. And I do like that because like, 
with waxing and stuff like that. You do have to wait a day or so until the redness goes down and the irritation goes down. And for me, I got no irritation or anything from this product. So like I said, I gave this a really, really great review. I'd recommend you guys trying it. I'll have the link down below at Ulta. Or if you want to get a Target, I'll have both those links down below. So I hope you guys liked watching this really quick video. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye, guys.